I have, I have two kids. I have a daughter. I have a daughter from my first marriage because I like souvenirs. And um, <laughs> I, haven't, I, have, I haven't been misleading. This is, I've been with my husband for, this, this, this husband I've been with for 20 years. I mean, you know, we're not newlyweds. I mean, we're still on our first bottle of Tabasco, but uh, you know, <laughs> that's gonna last us till the end. My daughter's in college. It's $63,000 a year to send this kid to college. 63,000, yes. For those of you with daughters, you will not be offended when I say that it is worth every penny to get that miserable human being out of my house. I would have... Oh no, did I say that out loud? I meant to just say that. If you didn't laugh at that, you either don't have daughters or you've forgotten what it's like to have a teenage daughter. You know, when you live with a teenage girl, you hear this sound all day long. You know the sound? It goes like this. <sighs> I walk into a room, I hear. <sighs> I have not seen this kid smile since she was 15. That's not true. A few days ago, she smiled because I tripped. And uh, <laughs> do you want to really feel sorry for me? $63,000 and she's an art major. for that joke, almost worth the money for that joke. I don't want you, listen, she's very talented. I don't want to give you the wrong idea. She, for, she, she painted for me my birthday. She painted a still life of a bowl of fruit. Magnificent, you should have seen the detail. It was, I said, this is magnificent. And when I'm 80 and I'm eating cat food, I can look at this and remember fruit. <laughs> So I, like I said, this is my second marriage, but I'm also my husband's second wife. So you know what that makes me, right? Yeah, the trophy wife, yeah. <laughs> don't look at me like that. You don't know what the first one looked like. I, I could be a huge improvement. I am the trophy wife. Okay, fine, it was a participation trophy. <laughs> My friend said, Corey, so the second wife is the trophy wife? What do they call the second husband? I said, a retirement plan. That's what they call this. <laughs> you wanna know how much I love my husband? You wanna know how much? I had my daughter when I was 22, and I had my son when I was 42. <laughs> yes, that is love. Am I right? That is love. Some people think I'm making that up. I once came off stage at a comedy club and this cocktail waitress came up to me and she goes, she goes, how did you do that? <laughs> and I said, well, let me put it in terms that you might understand. Imagine that I was the first girl at happy hour, but I stayed till last call. <laughs> My daughter was not thrilled when she found out that she was gonna have a sip. I thought she'd be so happy. She was an only child her whole life. She's like, way at college. I call her up, I said, guess what? You're gonna have a sibling. She was not thrilled. <laughs> Do you know what my daughter tells people behind my back? My mother's such a control freak, she had her own grandchild. <laughs> and then my son heard this and he got so upset. He goes, but what, mommy? When I have kids, you'll still be their grandma, right? <laughs> And I said, well, if I remember who you are. <laughs> but I'm having a great time with the, with, the, with the little boy. He's a little boy, he's 16. He's such a, he's so cute. My son has dyslexia, which by the way, not the end of the world. A lot of very successful people have dyslexia. But when he was first diagnosed, they said, you gotta let him have his feelings. Everybody get, let him have his feelings. So I let him have his feelings. And he's moping around the house for like a month. And finally, I, I said, listen, you gotta toughen up. Everybody gets a challenge in life. You just, you work hard, you persevere, you can overcome anything. And my son looked at me and he goes, well, did it work for you? <laughs> I said, what do you mean, did it work for me? Yes, I have two kids that I love, a husband that I love, I have a job that I love, people like me. And he looked at me and he goes, not everybody likes you. <laughs> he's funny, right? He's funny. <laughs> He's funny, he better be funny because he can't read. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. Make sure you download the Drybar app and use my promo code. You know I love promo codes, Corey Kahaney. Tough to spell, just Google it. Thank you.